Hi, I'm Sam from Huawei Developers, and welcome to Develop with HMS Core. Today, I'm going to show you how to integrate Huawei MapKit into your app. Huawei MapKit helps you personalize how your map is displayed and interacts with users for better location-based services. Huawei MapKit provides a standard map which you can customize for your specific service scenarios using elements such as markers, shapes, map layers, and user customization. With MapKit, users can interact with a map in your app through gestures and buttons, whatever the scenario. What's more, it allows users to plan routes for driving, cycling, walking, and other forms of travel in most countries and regions around the world. Bolstered with a wide range of map elements, Huawei MapKit empowers you to build a dedicated map for your app. It also provides an excess of 130 million POIs and 150 million addresses in over 40 languages for more than 200 countries and regions. Now, let's look at how you can integrate Huawei MapKit into your app. First, open Android Studio, select Empty Activity, give your app and app package a name, and click Finish to create an Android project. Then, on the official website of Huawei Developers, go to Console, App Gallery, select My Apps, click New, and enter the relevant information to create a project. Click the Develop tab. In the dialog box that is displayed, enter the app package name configured in Android Studio and click Save. On the Develop tab page, click the gear icon in the upper left corner Select Manage APIs and make sure that MapKit is enabled. Click Overview and download the AG Connect Services JSON file. Next, move the downloaded AG Connect Services JSON file to the app directory. Open the Build Gradle file. Add the Huawei Maven repository and add the AG Connect dependency in Dependencies. Open the build Gradle file in the app directory. Add the app gallery connect plugin, add the Huawei Maps dependency in dependencies, and add the app signature information. Then, add required location permissions in the Android manifest XML file. Open the main activity file. Implement the on map ready callback interface and add the required global variable and permission list. First, check permissions in the onCreate method. If there are no relevant permissions, apply for the permissions in the code. Then, bind the basic view component and execute the getMapAsync method to obtain the Huawei map instance. Next, implement the onMapReady method in onMapReady callback Bind the past Huawei map instance to the global variable HMAP and set basic parameters for HMAP. Finally, add a required marker and circle. Ensure that HMAP has the same lifecycle as the activity. And there you go. You've now integrated Huawei MapKit into your app. Let's launch the demo app to try it out. As we can see, the map has been gradually rendered. Click the plus and minus icons to zoom in and out on the map, or click the arrow icon to center on your device's location. Now you know just how easy it is to integrate Huawei MapKit into your app. Well, that's all for today's episode. If you have any questions, you can leave them in the comments area below or visit the Huawei developers website. And be sure to hit that subscribe button. Thanks for watching.